What's good, y'all? It's your boy Ross back at again with another video. So, you guys have been hitting me up on social media, mainly Twitter, about this very interesting clip that uh, has been floating around, has been gaining some traction today. So, a guy and a girl end up getting interviewed in a mall, basically asking to pretty much see if they could check each other's phone to uh you know see how well they trust each other if they trust their partner and boy does this go horribly wrong we gotta check this out apparently the guy had been messaging a fake Liv morgan oh my god we gotta check this out i haven't actually checked it out in its full entirety i've just seen like a little snippets of it from you guys sending it to me so we're definitely gonna check this one out because i already know this is about to be so cringe inducing appreciate all the love and support you guys have shown let's see uh this guy uh <laughs> mess up his relationship how long have y'all been together seven years uh, it's married five years eight years, eight years sorry oh well well, there we go. He he got he got the years messed up. <laughs> he said seven. She's like, it's really been eight. Been married five. So they're in a committed relationship. It's about to all go down the drain. <laughs> oh my god. Do y'all trust each other hundred percent? Yes. Maybe we test that theory. Sure, I guess. Swap phones. Is that fun? Yeah. Go real. Go through uh, Snapchat. Yeah. And when someone asks, like when they repeat a question to you, go through Snapchat. That should let you know this. When he hit that, go through Snapchat again. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. He he definitely had something to hide. <laughs> Cause if someone says, Hey, can they go through Snapchat? Your immediate response would be, sure. But he 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 hesitated and repeated it again. <laughs> Hey man, she passed the test, bro. I'm gonna go do this one, alright? I passed the test. Uh oh. Let's see if he passed the test. Who is Liv Morgan? WWE wrestler. Can we look through the chat? That's already a bad sign. Liv Morgan is not hitting you up on Snapchat. It, that's already a bad sign. Oh no. Oh no. Swipe up. Why didn't I hear from you? They Talk sent, to me, Robert. They sent stuff. I didn't reply back because I asked if she a WWE wrestler. She's like, yeah. And then she kept asking all these questions. Let's, let's keep swiping up. We gotta look through this. It's, it's already, it's already <laughs> looking like it's, it's about to go downhill very quickly. Just, it's, <sighs> I just want y'all to know, man. 10 times out of 10, these WWE wrestlers are not hitting you up especially in in the dms and especially on snapchat like oh my god are you single do you have children oh, i didn't answer it i thought it was stupid you did uh -oh. <laughs> oh no she hit the you did answer and he's like, uh, 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 wait <laughs> it's oh my it's ggs it's ggs it's over it's over before it started. Oh my goodness. Yeah, you get all of your fans. You get to know all your fans. Yeah. Oh no. He hit the you get to all get to know all your fans once again. I don't know how he didn't realize this was not a real person. This is someone pretending to be her. I don't know how he got finessed by that, bro. Hello, handsome. Just trying to holler at you. You been texting her back? No. Nope. Yep. Yes, you have. What's crazy is he's looking at it, right? And she's looking at it at the same time. So him saying, nah, nah, I ain't been messaging her. When she got the phone, she's looking at you, message her, my boy. You can't, you can't finesse your way out of this one. You just got to take the L. Nah, I ain't, I ain't been messaging her. She has the phone. She has the phone. She has the messages of you messaging a fake Liv Morgan. Oh my goodness, bro. Well, a little bit, but I didn't pay no attention to her. Oh no! I keep checking or 
No, because there's going to be more shit on there. <laughs> look at his face. <laughs> No, um, <laughs> y'all come. Look at his face. Bro. Oh, wait, 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 look at his face, bro. I'm sorry, bro. Look, look at that, oh, bro. No, um, y'all. He mad. At That's a face of like, look what you've done. I didn't do nothing. He is mad at the person interviewing him. All he had to do was say no, but he chose to go through with it. <laughs> he knew he was going to fail. Or maybe he thought she was going to check some other messages, but thought this face tells it all. Like, this is your fault, buddy. God damn it. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, <laughs> this was great. This was fantastic. That was fantastic. <laughs> this nigga got caught up with a fake Liv Morgan, bro. I'm done. Oh, my goodness. He should have aborted mission, bro. <laughs> That's a face of complete. Just what the hell? He put all the blame on the interviewer just with those facial expressions. You can tell he is upset, but it's his fault. Eight years, bro. Eight years of a relationship, <laughs> being married to this person, only to find out this nigga been texting a fake Lil Morgan and tried his best to get out of the situation like nah bro I, I was just it was just a couple messages but it it wasn't nothing serious y'all gotta stop man y'all gotta stop bro I'm telling you <laughs> gotta stop it just makes no sense for Liv Morgan to just be randomly asking you, hey, do you have any kids? Like, none of this, bro. Like, come on. <laughs> oh, my God. This was great. This was fucking... <laughs> oh, man. Well, I, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe they were able to patch up their relationship. I hope they were. Because that's mad. That's wild to lose your relationship over a fake Liv Morgan. That's just, just wild. <laughs> Comment down below. Let me know, man, what other uh, cringe videos you guys want me to check out. If it's on Instagram or Twitter, send it to me. I love doing these type of videos, man, because it's just... You can't make this stuff up. The internet is a very interesting place. So send me some more cringe clips, some cringe videos that you guys want me to react to and give my commentary to on the channel, man. I definitely will. I appreciate y'all sending this to me because this was just, <laughs> this is my laugh for the day, man. I know it's messed up to laugh at potentially someone's relationship being ru ruined, but it's his fault for even agreeing to do this knowing that she could possibly check out some of his messages he should have just kept it strictly to maybe his uh phone messages but once he said snapchat oh he should have aborted mission but it was too late then so this is really all on him man next next time just don't fall for the fake wwe wrestlers man it's it's 10 times out of 10 not them messaging you but i appreciate all love and support road to 150k and i'm still young speedy youtube wrestling champion of the world appreciate y'all kicking it with me see y'all next one peace